Okay, so this video is on multiplication, lesson five, using the area model and uh, the traditional algorithm for multiplication. So for the problem 143 times 12, first I'm gonna show you an area model. So for an area model, I'm going to draw a rectangle. This is just a representation, a visual res representation of the problem. So over here, I'm thinking of this as 143 times 12. And then to make 12 easier, or be, to make it so I can do this in my head and use mental math, I'm gonna think of 12 as 10 and two. And I'm just gonna divide my problem up. This box right here is gonna represent 143 times 10. So that I can do in my head. I am thinking one times 143, which is 143, but since it's actually 143 times 10, it would be 1,430. This box here represents 143 times two, which I can do in my head because I'm thinking two times 100, which is 200, two times 40, which is 80, and two times three, which is six. So now I've got two partial products for the problem 143 times 12. All I do is add these up, and I have 1,430 plus 286. 8 plus 3 is 11, 4 plus 2 plus 1 more, 7, and 1. So my answer is 1,716. Now for the traditional algorithm, or the standard algorithm, 143 times 12. Okay, so for this, I'm multiplying 2 times 3, which is 6. 2 times 4, 8. 2 times 1, 2. And now I'm blocking off my 1's place because I am multiplying from the 10's place. 1 times 3 is 3. 1 times 4, 1 times 1, and I add up my two partial products again, and you will notice, oops, I noticed that I made a mistake. <laughs> so you'll notice that my two products are the same. I've got 1,430, 1,430. I've got 286, 286. So add those up, 11, 7, and my products are the same. I've got 1,716, 1,716. 